The standard for a 154-pound bout is 10-ounce gloves, but Mayweather went on Instagram and challenged McGregor to go with smaller gloves. Mayweather posted, McGregor, let's fight in 8-ounce gloves, then added, don't believe what you hear in the media. Don't believe what you hear on blog sites. If it's not coming directly from me, then it's not true. I'm telling McGregor, let's fight in 8-ounce gloves. McGregor can fight in any brand he prefers or chooses. I'll be wearing eight ounce grant gloves. Whatever advantage McGregor needs to feel more comfortable in the ring, I'm willing to accommodate. Let's give the boxing and MMA fans what they want to see. Well, then McGregor responded on Instagram with an image in the boxing ring and said, another handy 12 rounds today. We are prepared to destroy Floyd. Pick whatever size gloves you want as well, little man. I fight with four ounces. I don't give a bleep about size of the glove. I am coming sprinting at you with bricks. Know that, brittle hands. The Nevada State Commission said they will not allow smaller gloves for the health and safety of the fighters. So that was a lot, but I wanted to make sure you guys had the full story before we get into this one. Skip, what is your take on everything that was just said? Yeah, Mr. Sharp. <laughs> <laughs> I am sick and tired of your man's posing and fronting and bluffing. This is classic Floyd may or may not weather because this is a big may not weather in the end. So as you know, at one of those media four media sessions, mm -hmm. he volunteered out of anger when his buttons got pushed by Conor McGregor, he volunteered, I'll wear four ounce gloves, which is what Conor wears MMA. in the MMA. Mm -hmm. Correct. And now he has gone, Floyd, onto Instagram to post a proclamation, a declaration that he will wear eight ounce gloves and he will allow Connor to wear eight ounce gloves of any brand of his choosing. And it comes across like a concession, a promise. And it's the biggest bunch of hot air that's ever come out of Floyd's mouth. This is nothing but fake toughness by a fake tough guy in Floyd Mayweather. You know it and I know Are it. Are you saying this is fake news? A uh, fake news. <laughs> it is fake news. Because the Nevada State Athletic Commission has a hard and fast rule, as the shrewd operator Floyd Mayweather knows all too well, a rule that if you box at 154, you must wear 10 ounce gloves. So. Floyd is huffing and puffing about, I'll wear eight. He, he even said he would wear four. Bring it on, Floyd. But, but Floyd knows he's going to be protected by the Nevada State Athletic Commission. And he is the cash cow for said commission because he lives and works in Las Vegas. And Las Vegas is about to stage the biggest sports event in Las Vegas history. Am I right about that? Yep the biggest cash cow event in Las Vegas history. So I dare you, Floyd, I challenge you to draw a line in the desert sand with the Nevada State Athletic Commission and say, guess what, guys? We will take our event to Madison Square Garden or Staples or Macau. We'll take it to Macau unless you bend the rule because this is a hybrid fight. This is MMA versus boxing. It's not pure boxer versus boxer. Bend your rule for our cash cow event, Las Vegas, or we will take our fight elsewhere. I dare you, Floyd, but you won't do it because you're chicken. You want a pillow fight. You want giant 10 ounce gloves so you can hide behind them and protect your arthritic hands. You just got called out by Conor McGregor. Brittle hands versus bricks. And Conor's going to be throwing bricks. And I would love to see you dare to, to accept those bricks with four ounce gloves. But I'll take eight. And you know and I know you won't do it because you're a coward when it comes oh, to the gloves. Whoa, Skip, he's where a is coward. coming from? When it comes to the gloves, he's a coward. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa, whoa. whoa. You Skip. know it. I just called him out because I nailed him. Right now, I'm going to need yeah. you at a three. That was like a 10 or 11. I need you at a three right now. So I need you to take it down a couple of octaves, okay? Am I right? No. You know I'm right. Skip. You know I'm right. I've said this all along. When you get into the moment, you say things. You're like, did I say that? Kind of like the Packers CEO. Remember, he said, oh, the Packers are going to the Super Bowl. That's going to be great. Dry the mental soda. And then he thought about it like, I probably shouldn't have said that. Skip. I, I thought hard about saying this. And I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i say it again if you want me to. Skip. You're a coward when it comes to 10-ounce gloves. Skip. Sorry. You the don't whole, have to apologize. The You're good. The <laughs> whole thing, the whole, all I wanted to know was what weight they were going to fight at. <laughs> 
Once I knew it was 154, I knew it was going to be 10 ounce gloves. Skip, think about this. Floyd Mayweather is 49 and 0. He's had three fights at 154. He fought Miguel Cotto. He fought Oscar De La Hoya. He fought Canelo Alvarez. The other fight have been at 147. Now, the last time he fought, I mean, think about when last he fought Canelo, what, what was that, 2013, 2012? Skip, he went to 154 because he wanted those 10-ounce gloves. You knew that. I know that. Okay, so are you, Shannon Sharp, saying, a Hall of Famer, by the way, mm -hmm. a pro football Hall yes. of Famer, a real tough guy, Shannon yes. Sharp, yes. are you saying you are afraid of 8-ounce gloves? No, the rules, there are rules, Skip. The rule says if you fight at 154, you use 10-ounce gloves. If at 147 a down, you use 8-ounce gloves. Skip, this is a sanctioned boxing match, sanctioned by the Nevada Athletic Commission. Are you going to hide behind that rule again? Skip, if you remember, what happened in 1982 that caused boxing to go from 15 rounds to 12? Ray Boom Boom Mancini killed Duke Koo Kim in the ring. They went from 15 to 12. And you heard the Nevada Athletic Commission say, we're not altering these rules for the protection of the fighters. Okay, so you are, are you admitting you fear that Floyd might get actually killed in the ring with eight-ounce gloves? Skip. I I'll, think you're scared. That, I do. Skip. So that would be like a team saying, you know what? I don't care. I'll play the Patriots. We can play 20-minute quarters. The NFL says you play 15-minute quarters unless it's overtime, and now they're thinking about revamping those rules. Skip, we're not, they're not bending the rules because once you start... You know what the Patriots would say? Fine. Let's play 15. But that's what the rules and you say. know who would win? The Patriots what, would win. What, what, Just are, by a bigger score. What, what does the rules say? Are you hiding behind rules that apply to boxing when this is hybrid it, fighting? There's no hybrid. Yes, there is. There's no kicking. So where is the hybrid at? The only difference is, is that one of the fighters does not have a, bo a pure boxing background. So where is the hybrid at? Has Conor McGregor ever boxed professionally one round of his life? I don't know. No, he has not. Okay, so okay. therefore he's not a Hybrid. Fighter. So he is daring to fight Floyd on his turf. And Floyd is volunteering, conceding, promising, let's go eight ounces. He even went to four ounces they're not, when pressed. They're not going four. They're not going eight. There's a reason why Floyd wanted this fight at 154. Skip, if this is a hybrid, what can Conor McGregor do in the boxing ring, I mean in the MMA ring, that he can't do in the boxing ring? So where's the hybrid? I I'm trying to figure, can he kick? Can he take him down? I'm can he elbow him? The fight is out of the box. It's combat at a different level. No, it's not. It's yes, it is. They got on boxing gloves. They're going to go by boxing rules. Con Conor McGregor, Conor is McGregor has Conor McGregor ever worn 10 ounce gloves in his life? No, because no. He's, an, he's an MMA fighter. So is Conor McGregor a pillow fighter? Do you want this to be a pillow fight where Floyd can run, run, run for 12 rounds and hope that the judge is protected? Can I ask you a question? If there's a fighter fighting in Conor in MMA, can he recommend they fight in eight ounce gloves? Or what are the rules? What's the rule for MMA? You use but what he, type of he, gloves? He doesn't need eight ounce gloves. He wouldn't I, want eight ounce gloves. He wants four ounces. What In are fact, the rules? You know what Conor McGregor would do for any MMA fight, for any UFC fight? What? He'd fight bare knuckle. If the other guy wanted what? to fight bare knuckle, just fight bare knuckle. Johnny Bones Jones is ready. What? To fight bare knuckles. Okay, but he weighs 210 whoa, whoa. pounds. Hold on. But fact, you keep. John but you Jones keep... told me after the weigh in, he goes up to like 220 or so. Yeah. Well, he was keeping. On the show, he was 220 and he had to be the 205. Well, that's what Skip. I'm saying, but he said he goes yeah. back up to 220. Well, Skip, you so you want Conor McGregor at 150 to fight 220? You told me he's the baddest man on the he planet. He is. Well, well, I mean, the size does matter in this after no. a while. But he did fight Nate Diaz, who weighed probably close to 200. Johnny Bone Jones just called out Brock Lesnar, who at the weigh-in will weigh 265. And I guarantee you on fight night, he'll be around 280, 290, 300. Okay. And Bones called him out. Because he said, I'm the baddest man on the planet, Connor. Well, let's stay on topic here because you're trying to, to dance around the topic because you know I've skip. got you on no, this. You, skip. The, the problem is that Floyd is saying it, and you and I know if, if he says it, if he declares it and concedes it on Instagram in writing, don't listen to the media, then should I take Floyd at his word? Or do you agree it's nothing but hot air? It's fake toughness. I told you that. And he said it. 
because he knew the Boxing Commission would not relent on these rules, Skip. And if he tried to, you think he owes the IRS? How much you think they would sue Floyd for if he tried to pull out of this fight and well, take it's it somewhere? Not, well, you can take it somewhere else. How? Would Madison Square Garden take this fight? Yeah. Would Staples? He, Skip, he, owe, he owes the IRS. Do you want to play for a building that you're not going to fight in? Because they, they, they just bought an ice cube out of that. Okay. You still won't go head on against the point. Would you be afraid for Floyd's safety with eight ounce gloves? The rules say. I don't care what the rules say. Would oh, you so be that, afraid? Oh, you no, break rules? Forget about the rules. Just in a vacuum. Would I'm a you rule, fear for Floyd. I'm a rule oh, follower. You're, I you're do everything by the, the rules. If the speed limit says 35, I'm going 35. If it says 80, I'm going 80. If it says do not litter, I'm not throwing trash and on I, the road. I, I told you. The baddest man on the planet would fight him back in some alley in Hollywood right now. Bare knuckles. We can we bare go, knuckles. We can fight on August twenty sixth. If Floyd is the greatest three, defensive fighter ever, and you say that Conor McGregor cannot quote unquote lay a glove on Floyd, what are you afraid of? Skip. You know what? what? You're afraid of the baddest man on the You're planet. To you know it, and I know Skip. it. You are, and it's okay. I I give it to you. You can be afraid. For your man's safety, you, know, you need ten ounce gloves. You know, something. What you trying to do to me is that you trying to do me and Floyd. You trying to coax us out. But I'm in my I'm in my element, Skip. I'm a rule for. I don't like to break the rules uh -huh. because you know, breaking the rules could get someone hurt mm. in any in any aspect of life, Skip. So I just follow the rules. Only one participant could get hurt here, and it's Floyd. Hold may on. Or may not if wait. he has so much dynamite and uh, uh, lightning and thunder in mm. these hands, yep. knock him out with those pillows. Bricks. Bricks are coming. Well, okay, so so what's the problem, Skip? The problem is that, that it's all hot air.